This is Jeffrey Drazen for the New England Journal of Medicine. You don't have to be an old salt to know that salt has always been important. During the Trans-Saharan gold trade in the 7th century, caravans of camels would carry cargoes of salt to trade for gold, or bars of gold to trade for salt, sometimes ounce for ounce. Such was the value of and need for salt. Nowadays, with shakers of salt on our tables, has the salt trade grown more sinister? Are we bartering our own good health for the seductive flavor of salt? Humans need salt, yet eating a lot of salt is associated with elevated blood pressure, which is a major risk factor for cardiovascular disease. Current guidelines recommend sodium intake of no more than 2 grams per day. That's less than a teaspoon of salt a day. Oh, we've sailed the briny deep to bring you three studies that investigate the role of salt in cardiovascular disease. In one, sodium intake was estimated in 66 countries. The study estimated that globally, more than 1.5 million cardiovascular deaths in 2010 could be attributed to a sodium consumption of greater than 2 grams per day. That's about 1 in 10 cardiovascular deaths. Deaths related to salt consumption were highest in the country of Georgia and lowest in Kenya. Not to rub more salt in your wound, but another study looked at the amount of sodium that was excreted in 100,000 individuals from 18 countries. The association between the intake of sodium and blood pressure was most pronounced in people with hypertension, in older individuals, and those who consumed large amounts of salt. The risk of elevated blood pressure was modest in those consuming 3 to 5 grams per day, and there was no significant association in those who consumed less than 3 grams per day. The third study also involved over 100,000 individuals from 17 countries and showed that a high sodium intake, that is more than 6 grams per day, was associated with a higher risk of mortality in cardiovascular events. Interestingly, a low sodium intake, that's less than 3 grams a day, was also associated with a higher risk of death in cardiovascular events. A moderate sodium intake, that's between 3 and 6 grams per day, was associated with the lowest risk of events. Should we take these results with a grain of salt? No way. The data show that most of the world eats too much salt. So throw that salt shaker overboard, but keep a little salt handy so you can toss it over your shoulder from time to time. Since so many foods from all over the world are loaded with salt, a little good luck might be needed.